Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna show you guys the Pillow Talk Dreams palette. I have tried the original Pillow Talk palette before, but wow, it. <laughs> I don't know what's up with the colors against my skin tone with that one, but I looked terrible, like sickly terrible. So I returned that so fast. I'm just gonna tell you right now, I really love this. This is not my first time using this. I have used this a countless times since I bought it. It is just so easy to use. It looks great. Now it's time for the unboxing and a swatch it. start with the prime shade which is this one right here this is a beautiful pinky champagne type of shade and I'm gonna use that to prime my eyelids just like Charlotte Tilbury recommends us to I did put a eye primer already I use the Mac uh, 24 hour primer and I'm just gonna you know basically set it with that and I usually just apply it like in the inner half and then I put some right here as the highlight and just kind of whatever left over just kind of bring it over to the other side and there you go that's it okay this is how the shade looks like next i'm gonna go in with the shade enhance which is a beautiful like sunsetty type of warm pink that's how i could explain it well it's not pink peachy pink sunsetty peachy pink And I'm applying it in the outer half of my eye and the crease. Now I'm gonna go to this shade, the smoke shade. And this is just like a dark brown. And I'm gonna use Sonia G Soft Shader. And I'm gonna apply it right here. Just in the outer V of my eyelids. I'm just gonna keep the shade right there. This brown is so nice, oh my gosh. After the color is deposited on that side, I just use whatever's left over and kind of, you know, blend this part right here. I'm gonna go back to the enhanced shade for my lower lash line. And I always connect it right here. It helps with my, I don't know, just the shape of my eye to make it look, you know, more cohesive and even. Okay, now I am going to the darkest shade, the smoke shade, and concentrate that on the outer lower lash line and on to the other side now i'm gonna go back to the soft shader by sony g and then just blend the lower lash line i love this brush because you can use it for so many things i but i specifically really love it for the lower lash line it's just perfect i am gonna go back to this shade, the prime shade, I'm gonna use the Sonia G Builder 3 and kind of deepen up, I mean deepen up, like add more sparkliness in the inner half of my eyelid. Okay, 
Wow, just look at that. Oh, so pretty. So I'm applying that mostly on the eyelid and then I'm gonna go back with the pop shade later. Gonna go to the pop shade right here and I'm just gonna use my finger. Or actually, I think I'm just gonna keep it like on the outer third. I don't know, I'll apply it all over. But yeah, that's how it looks like with the pop shade compared to this one. The pop shade is pretty uh it's like not a pop shade i just think it's like a shimmer you know like her other pop shade is like more translucent but this is the new pop shade i guess it's so pretty since this one is n i don't think it's light enough is it okay let's just try it i'm gonna use the sonia g flat definer brush it's this little tiny thing right here and I'm gonna apply that just in the inner corner and then a little bit down here and that is how the highlight looks like it's not as light as I would like it for my skin tone really I don't know what do you think I'm gonna use this uh, looser brush pencil brush um, this is by Shikohodo I'm just gonna apply that right right there yeah, I think it's a little bit dark. I actually really like this highlighter a lot for face and for the eye. So I'm gonna use um, this shade right here, this pinky shade, and I am gonna apply that in the inner. Oh gosh, I just love this highlight. Okay, I like that a lot better. It definitely brighten up my inner corner. Love. And then I'm gonna apply that also on my brow bone. Ooh, that's really pretty. I'm gonna use the liquid eyeliner by Stila and I'm gonna also apply mascara, which is Rare Beauty. So I will be right back. Okay, so the mascara and the eyeliners are on. Um, I think I'm gonna deepen up this area right here with a pencil brush and I'm gonna use this shade. And I'm going back with the smoke shade and filling this area right here. I'm gonna take this soft shader and I'm gonna buff that out. I'm gonna use Hot Gossip by Charlotte Tilbury for my lip liner. And then I'm gonna use Pillow Talk lipstick. All right, guys, that is the finished look. I hope you love it. I mean, you already saw it in the beginning of the video. Let me know in the comments below if you have this palette, the Pillow Talk Dreams, and how you like it compared to the Pillow Talk original palette. If you're interested in watching more videos, especially eyeshadow videos and reviews, I suggest you check out this video right here. This is the NARS Summer Unrated Palette. It is also is so beautiful. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you in my next video. Oh, and don't forget, have a beautiful, wonderful day!